Senator, Senator Gravel, <laughs> at a forum earlier this year, I want to get this right, you said it doesn't matter whether you are elected president or not, so then why are you here tonight? Shouldn't debates be for candidates who are in the race to win the race? Ryan, you're right, I made that statement, but that's before I had a chance to stand with them a couple, three times. It's like going into the Senate. You know, the first time you get there, you're all excited. My God, how did I ever get here? Then about six months later, you say, how the hell did the rest of them get here? Do you think Joe Biden will be uh, of any help? Lots of talk about him being the vice president. Joe Biden, I, yeah, I know Joe Biden very well. I served with him. Joe Biden's a fine person. Problem is, he's not going to add anything to the ticket. Joe Biden is, is an American imperialist. He believes in American power. And that's what's wrong with the, the establishment in Washington today. They want to continue American imperialism, which sustains the military industrial complex, which is where all of our financial resources are going. If Hillary Clinton, who's the front runner right now in all of the polls, gets the Democratic presidential nomination, could you support her? I've stated first thing right at the Democratic uh, winter meeting that I do not feel, and I don't want to address the support or not support, I do not feel that a person who voted for the war, because that's the judgment call, is qualified to be President of the United States. Fifty million Americans made an opposite decision. Fifty million Americans made, had better judgment than Hillary did. That doesn't make her a bad person. It's just that she doesn't have the judgment in my mind to be president. So John Edwards, when he was in the Senate, voted for that resolution as well. So did Joe Biden and well, Chris Dodd. Well, it cleans up the... Cleans well, Barack up the, Obama was not in the Senate, but he did oppose it. That, no, fine. I'm fine. And, uh, but, you know, Barack Obama may have some other holes someplace. Wait, let me just ask a couple of questions. You say that if you elected Obama, it would be electing, like electing Hamlet. Oh, that's true. What, 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 just listen. What, what does he say? A little bit of this, a little bit of that. You know, thoughtful. Uh, he doesn't have give hope. Well, hope without definition means nothing. It's it, and look where his money's coming from. It's not coming from people who need hope. It's coming from Wall Street. It's coming from the hedge funds. An interesting phenomenon. Time to make some waves for change. I'm Mike Gravel, and I'm running for president.